Hi, this is a project that we made uh, for my niece who is studying in ninth class. This is actually a working model of a windmill uh, in which if we move this fan, I can show you, then this LED will light up. This is a working model. I'll later tell you how we made it and what was the stuff that we used. See, uh, if I will move this fan, you will notice this, that this LED will uh, flicker. See, this is the way I am moving the fan and this LED flickers. And if I throw uh, some high pressure air on it through my vacuum cleaner, uh, this RAN moves fast and continuously and this LED runs continuously. Uh, now I'm gonna tell you how we made it. We took a wooden base and we uh, fixed a wooden stick or a pole sort of thing on it uh, using nails, right? Metal metallic nails. And then uh, we drilled a hole in this uh, pole as you can see here. And we took an old pen, you see? This is uh, the body of the pen. We have cut it from the front and then we fixed a uh, C. This is a fan that we purchased from local electrical shop and we fixed this pen on this fan and uh, we moved this pen through this hole, right? Now we, when we move it, it moves without friction, almost, right? And then we fixed uh, another wooden block here on this shaft. And then we took two old CDs and cut them short and uh, fixed on the both sides of this wooden block so that this uh, rubber band doesn't come off. And this is a... This is a small motor uh, that we purchased from local electrical shop. Uh, you can find it of some other shape, but you will be able to find this thing, similar thing, right? Which has two uh, connectors for wires and then this moving small metallic shaft. It does both functions. You know, if you give DC electricity uh, to those connectors this shaft moves and the other way around also that when you move this shaft it produces a DC current in those connectors so we have used it as dynamo we have used it as uh, when we move this shaft it runs this LED as you can see see right uh, so we took this wooden block pasted two CDs on the both sides so that the rubber band doesn't slip and we uh, uh, winded up this rubber band over these two the, this wooden block and this small shaft and we uh, fixed it with this pole using a wide uh, cello tape and this uh, on the back side if you can see mm. these are the uh, connectors were on the back side so we soldered this wire and these two wires on those connectors and we run this wire across uh, this apparatus and to this uh, small pole electricity pole right where we have shown how windmill can produce electricity so this is a working model thank you